Hey, over here. Good to see you. How are you doing this morning? Good, I'm glad. I'm doing well, thanks. Was the walk over here okay? Yeah, it's not a far walk from the school dorms. I loved coming to this coffee shop first thing before class. It's so cute and cozy. Plus, it's way cheaper than the campus cafe. It's like $4 for just a black coffee there. <laughs> Absolute thievery. <laughs> I'd end up doing most of my homework here because my dorm room was so cramped, especially when I had to share it with a roommate. Yours is too? I swear, they're built for like guinea pigs or something. <laughs> You've got two feet of floor before running into a bed. It's hard to get any work done in them. I'm eternally grateful to have my own office at the gallery now. Oh, it's almost too spacious. Hmm, I wonder. Anyway, I'm excited you took me up on my offer of a city tour. I had a fun time talking with you the other night. I'm glad we get to see each other again, especially under less stressful circumstances. <laughs> and speaking of seeing you, I see this outfit you got on. You look gorgeous. <laughs> oh, there's that blush again. <laughs> I didn't mean to catch you off guard there. Haven't quite woken up yet. Well then, let's wake you up with some good old dirty bean water. <laughs> Can I buy you a cup? I insist. Think of it as my treat for doing your first ever gallery. Hi, can I get a small iced oat milk latte with two pumps of vanilla? And what would you like? Yes, just those two. Thank you. So, while we wait on those, what have you been up to since I last saw you? Right, school starts in a couple of days for you. Are you feeling ready? Yeah, that's understandable, but you've just moved to a new city and you're starting at a new school. It's perfectly okay to be a bit nervous. I'd honestly be concerned if you weren't nervous. <laughs> Do you know something I don't? <laughs> but it's good to see you looking on the bright side of things. You seem more confident than the last time we talked. What? Thanks to me. Oh, oh, that's so sweet of you. It makes me happy to know that us talking meant that much to you. And now you're not facing all of this craziness totally alone. Oh, our order's ready. Thank you again. Now that we have our wake-up juice, let's get this tour started. And over there is the thrift shop. You can find some pretty cool vintage clothing over there. That's actually where I got these beauties. Well, I mean, minus the paint and such. <laughs> hey, I'm allowed to be comfy while making stuff. Not everything has to be nice and fancy. <laughs> What's up? Something catch your eye? Oh, that mural over there. Yeah, isn't it beautiful? This was an abandoned building for a while before this. People used to spray paint that wall like crazy. <laughs> the designs people were making got bigger and crazier every week. Then someone snuck around one night and this popped up the next morning. It hasn't been touched since. Even the new owners of the building left it up because it got so popular. What do you mean that takes you back? To when? You? You used to do graffiti back in high school. Wow, I didn't take you to be a little rebel. Just because you did it briefly where you weren't seen doesn't make you any less of a vandalizer. Yes, a vandalizer, tagger, troublemaker, or whatever the adults called you. Gosh darn kids. I'm just teasing you. <laughs> it's hard not to when you get that adorably shocked look on your face. 
That's actually cool you used to do that. How did you get into it? Ah, I see. One internet deep dive later and you're taking old spray cans from the garage. <laughs> do you have any photos of your old work? I wanna see. Oh, wow. Those look awesome. How did you do that part there? Oh, I see. And what about this? Oh, cool. See, I knew you had to have a dark side to you somewhere. You couldn't be that sweet. Tell me more. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've seen their stuff. Oh yeah, that trend lasted for a while, didn't it? Oh yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, so... Got it, got it. Wow, you know quite a bit. What? No, you didn't go on too long. I was enjoying hearing you explain it to me. Seeing you talk so passionately about it, you get this little spark in your eye and this wide grin you can't seem to contain. It's so charming. Wait, did you have a tag name then? Like how graffiti artists write fake names? Did you give yourself a nickname? You did! What was it? Yes, I promise I won't laugh. Ghost Wolf. No, I, no I, I'm not laughing. I swear. I'm just... Don't be embarrassed. I think it's the perfect name for an angsty 15-year-old to come up with. You should have seen my old online username. It was way worse than you could imagine. Oh no, I'm not telling you. I just said it's way worse. I... Fine, I'll tell you, but only because you have very convincing puppy dog eyes. It was Twilight Queen. <laughs> Are you giggling at my impeccable naming skills? How dare you? <laughs> hey, while we are taking a break on this tour, I wanted to ask you something. At the coffee shop, when we talked about the dorms, an idea popped into my head. Like we said, the dorms are too tiny to work in, and I know the campus classrooms tend to always be filled with students working 24-7, so there isn't always a workstation available. It can be hard to find a space for yourself. Well, my office at the gallery is actually an old art studio that never got any use. Since I started working there, I've been remodeling and trying to bring some life back into it with a small desk and a couch, but even with that, it's still way too much space for just me to use alone. Yes, this is going somewhere. <laughs> All this to say, I want to offer that extra space for you to use. It's hard to hear someone like you be stuck trying to work and create in such a cramped space. I'll have to talk to my boss, but I'm very certain she'll understand. So, what do you think? Want to share the studio space with me? Great! <laughs> I'll get to see the behind the scenes of your work too, see your creative process. The gallery isn't far from here, actually. We can stop by and I can show you the space. You'll love it. <laughs>